Hey guys, it's Alex. Welcome back to another episode. If you don't see this shit right here, I'm gonna put it in a little bit closer. Yeah, bitches, I did. So should you if you're 18 or older and live in the United States. Come on, we need those votes, baby. Okay, moving on from the political part, let's get right into the sports. Well, as a depressed Giants fan, I hate covering the NFL. And well, as a depressed Giants fan, I have to feel bad for the one other franchise that's even more depressed than us. And that is the Cleveland Browns. However, today is a good day for the Cleveland Browns because they have fired Hugh Jackson. And I mean, look, for all the people that think this is good, this, no, this is bad, they have to like commit to him. He's part of the rebuild. No, he's just downright awful. I mean, when he made comments like this, he said yesterday, is when a reporter asked him, How many timeouts do you have? Why didn't you use any of the timeouts before the half ended? He says, I don't recall that. He didn't remember he had timeouts. That just shows you're a shit coach, not because you're on a shit team. So, Hugh Jackson gone, Ty Lue gone, hallelujah to Cleveland. Finally get rid of the shit, maybe you can get some success. Yo, Oklahoma, you remember their head coach? You'd be a great fit with Baker, all I'm saying. And they also fired Todd Haley, which is actually surprising because they just signed him. I thought they would commit to him because he's their first year. He's the actual long term, not Hugh Jackson's been there for three years. However, if Riley wants to bring all the staff from Oklahoma to the Cleveland Browns, let let that man do what he does because he's the guy that will make Baker great. Let me know what you guys think. As a Browns fan, do you like this or will hate this? And well, other than the NFL and sad news with Lester with their owner, prayers go up to him. There really hasn't been much news. And yeah. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe. If you're new here, please follow our Instagram and Twitter down below. And peace.